I want to talk a little bit about Garson syndrome. And Garson is just an eponym. And what it means is that you have a unilateral and progressive cranial neuropathy. So it's all on the same side. And what it normally means is if you're jumping from one cranial nerve to the next cranial nerve, and they're numbered, as you know, one through 12. However, the most common for us are gonna be the ones that affect us. Two, three, four, five, and six. However, because cranial nerve two is the optic nerve and normally is in the intraorbital portion, intracranial portion chiasm, that one doesn't really run with the other cranial nerve. So when we're talking about a typical Garson syndrome, normally what happens is you start somewhere like a five, and then it goes anteriorly and posteriorly from there. And what that means is a skull-based lesion, a lesion that's based in the skull, or an infiltrative process that's just creeping along the skull base can start with a five, they have a numb phase, and then they have a six in diplopia, and, and if it goes into your cavernous sinus, a three and a four, and if it goes in your orbital apex, a two. So you have an optic neuropathy, a cavernous sinus syndrome, a six nerve palsy, and if it goes posteriorly, then you're talking about seven and eight and nine and 10 and 12. And so it's just a slowly progressive process of, that's creeping along the skull base that is slowly taking up ipsilateral cranial nerves. And that was what Garson described, Garson syndrome. And it's usually skull base infiltrative lesions skull base, osteomyelitis, metastatic lesions. It's gotta be something slowly creeping along the skull base. And the key and differentiating features are it's unilateral, it's progressive, it jumps from one cranial nerve to the other in a sequential order, either anteriorly or posteriorly or both. And it doesn't have any long track signs. So they don't have any brainstem involvement. They don't have any involvement of their pons. They're not weak, it's just ipsilateral, progressive, unrelenting, sequential cranial neuropathies on the same side. You need to image it, of course, and the name of that thing is Garson.